What's going on YouTube? Gio right here. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to install the Houdini for the iOS 11.3.1 and older with the new exploit that doesn't require a developer account, so anybody can use it. Yes, the Houdini has been released for iOS 11.3.1. The Beta 3 R1 has been released by Abraham Masri just a few hours ago, and this one is actually based on a new exploit called Empty List by Iron Beer. Now, this exploit is going to be covered in my next video, so stay tuned for that. But for the moment, suffice it to say that Abraham Masri has updated Houdini in order to work with this exploit that doesn't require a developer account. So while you're waiting for the Electra jailbreak to come, it's actually safe to use the Houdini. Now, Houdini can be found here on the website, the link is in the description down below. And Houdini, although it's not a jailbreak, it allows you to customize a lot your device. So I'm going to show you how to install it. So you have to press download in here, you're going to get the IPA and you're going to sign it with the CDA Impactor and as I said, it doesn't require any developer account. So we're going to go ahead and do that, I have connected my device, which is a test device in here and I'm going to take the Houdini IPA, drop it in here and of course sign in with my account, be right back. Okay, so as you can see, it starts signing everything in here and it's going to ask me which team I'm going to use since I also have a developer account in here. But I'm not going to use the developer account, I'm going to use my personal account, which is completely free, the John Smith one. So I'm going to press in here and it's going to sign everything and we're going to go to the device and see exactly how it looks like. So we're going to wait for it to finish everything in here. All right, so this is the device in here running iOS 11.3.1, and this is the Houdini application, the last one installed in here. You'll have to trust the application in the settings as normal, but the reason I'm not running it for the moment is because the new exploit that Beer has published is actually very unstable. He said that only like 30% of the time it has a success rate, so it's definitely not as good as the one that requires a developer certificate. This one, however, doesn't require a developer certificate, but it will take an awful amount of tries to get it working in anything. And of course, it's not the fault of Houdini or Abraham Mass it's just the exploit that is not reliable. So this is the reason I'm not going to open Houdini right now, because if I do, it will most likely crash my device and stop the recording. Now, it may crash a lot of times for you. I have seen people saying that it may take even 25 attempts, 9 attempts. In my case, on this iPhone 6 iOS 11.3.1, it never worked. I only got restarts. So yeah, it depends on your device probably and depends on how lucky you are. But anyways, yeah, if you want to install this and if you want to try it, go ahead. But I would definitely recommend it to wait for the Electra. Anyways, if you are going to use Houdini, please keep in mind that it's actually pretty safe and it can be removed if you want to remove it in the future and it's not going to mess up your entire file system. Of course, you have to keep in mind that you should not change the device's resolution, especially if you don't know what you're doing, because you may end up messing up your device. So yeah, this is pretty much it, guys. Thank you for watching. I'm sorry I cannot show you the Houdini application working, but yeah, it would take an awful amount of tries for me to get it working on this device. So this is the reason I'm not opening it right now. Anyways, thank you for watching. I'm Geo Snow. Until the next time, peace out.